Hello and welcome back to Funny Megita Jones. Today is savings challenge day, y'all. So we're going to try to do all the things with only $44. So what does that mean? Stay tuned. <laughs> So welcome back y'all. As I said, we are going to be trying to do all the different things in our savings, savings challenge video. Um, we're going to try to do a hound envelope. We're going to try to do some flashcards and we're going to try to do my low, low denomination savings challenges. I know it's a lot. I only have $44. So we're not quite sure how we're going to do this, but we're going to figure out how to do it. So with the hundred envelope savings challenge, I thought that we, Hey, this is an interesting idea. Why don't we go in order of envelope? <laughs> I know it's crazy. So <laughs> we're going to try to work our way through this. It's going to be y'all. This is going to be terrifying, terrifying, terrifying. Okay. So the next envelope up is number 18. So hold on and let me pull 18 and I will be right back. Okay. So welcome back. It took me a moment because my envelopes are all cattywampus, but I did find number 18 and I'm excited to report that 18 already has money in it. So yay for 18. So what we're going to do is we're going to take out our dice. I know this is different than what I usually do, but you know, you know me, I like to switch it up. We're going to take out my dice and the dice, these, I'm using these small dice because they only go up to 12 so I can't do too much damage. We're going to see how much we're going to put into this envelope and hopefully we can finish it. So we've got $10 that we can put into this envelope. Oh, I didn't even sort out my money. Hold on, hold on. Before we do this, I'm gonna go ahead and sort out my money. I'm just getting ahead of myself, y'all. And did I count the money? No, I did not. So let's go ahead and count the money, okay? We got five, 10, 15, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44. I thought it was $40 for a second. I go, oh, I got more money than I should. Okay, so we got $40, $44, $44 that we're putting in the cash tray. And I remember the number was $10 that we're putting into this envelope. And if it's if if it's fully, if I, okay, we'll, we'll just do it and we'll just we'll talk our way through it. So we have $10 here that we're going to be putting in the envelope, okay? And we're going to see how much is in here. And whatever overages, we're just going to put into the number 21 envelope. Let's do that. Oh, my God. Okay. So we've got 5, 15, 17, 18. $18 is fully funded. Very exciting. And we're going to take this 5 and put it into the next envelope. And what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? We're going to put this in the back. I, I, you guys, I finished off a full envelope. Very exciting. And we're going to put this extra five into 21. So we're going to pull 21, which is right here. And we're going to put five in there. And we're going to just keep chugging along. It's kind of like how we do our annuals. So there we go. We're going to put our dice away. We're going to put our our card away and I'm going to make sure that I put that I put ten dollars into this challenge on my in my budget because I have to transfer it to my n1 account so 100 envelope it's very awkward to do this like this we put ten dollars into the hundred envelope okay so there we go. Close that up, put that away, and let's go to the next challenge. So, okay. So we're gonna pull we're gonna pull a couple cards here. I'm gonna put this off to the side. We're probably gonna only do one or two cards. I don't know what we're gonna do. We're I don't know. I don't know. We're gonna try to do all the things. I don't know why I'm shuffling, but we're gonna shuffle anyway. I have so little cards left, but let me just tell you, these cards are probably really expensive. So, oh, let's do this. Let's do this. So. Okay, 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 okay. 
I'm looking forward to getting through the challenges because I've created some new challenges I want to do and ugh, I have to finish up these first. So let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Let's see what we can do. So we've got that one, that one, and that one. Okay. We've added up. If we do add it up. Ooh. Okay, wait a minute. Okay, 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 wait a minute. I think we might look out here because I excuse me. I did one half of added up. Limited space here. One half of added up. So which side did I do? The 16th side, which we're looking at, or the nine side. Oh, we did the 16th side. So that means we can go ahead and do the nine side. Five, eight, and seven. Oh, let's use, let's use this nine. So we're going to put nine dollars in here. And that means we can retire this card because this whole card has been done, man. If I can get this little post-it off, it doesn't seem to want to leave. And we could put... Put $9 in here. We're going to put that right there. $9 in here. And let's see. Let's see. Can we do any more? It's 10 and 8. I think we're going to put this back in the no-go pile. And let's see. I'll put that right there. And this one. Let's see you. Do we have any actual letters? No, we don't. Okay, let's see. If, if let's see, let's just see if we can do anything with these guys. <laughs> Excuse me. I don't think we can. So we have a nail and an onion. Those are too expensive. We have a house and a giraffe. I might be able to do six, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, but then I wouldn't be able to do the other half. Now I'm going to skip it. I'm going to skip it. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. I'm going to skip it. Okay. Oh, we definitely can't do the lemon and the monkey. So we only could do one challenge on this, on this run. Ah, so sad. So sad. Um, let's see. Maybe I will do... I'm going to do the giraffe. I've decided. I'm going to do the giraffe, which is 14. And I'm going to do like I did with the other card. I'm going to take this, and I'm going to say that this is done. And it's going to go back to the pile. And so that means I just have to do the house. Okay. We're going to do that. We're going to do that. Five, seven, uh, seven, seven, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14. Okay, that's what we're going to do. So we have $14 into the added up. Before I forget, I'm going to put this in the book because I will forget. We will forget. Okay. So we've got add it up. We have $14. No, we added up, we have $9. $9 and ABC. And fourteen dollars. Okay, there we go. So we can now put our money away. We did cross off one on each, so I feel like we made progress here. I said I was going to try to do all the things, and I did a, a little bit of all the things. So the rest of this money is going to go into my mini challenges. I feel like this cash, this stuffing has been kind of all over the place, but you know what? That's okay. That's okay. It's fun for me. So we're going to put that in here. Let me make sure it's $9. Yes, it's $9. We're going to put that in there. And we're going to take out this big bow bundle. Bundle of joy. Oh my gosh, you guys. I really did do all a little bit of everything. I'm very proud of myself. Okay. We're going to put you off to the side so you're out of the way. And we didn't need to take out the money, but we did. So we're going to, let's see. Put you right there. Okay. So we have, I'm not going to, okay. 
We're gonna save this one for last. So D's, this is from D's, this is from D's Digital World. This is pick a random number and it totals $103. Uh, her YouTube name is D, it's D Bankroll. So I'm, I'm holding it this way, I'm sure you can't see it. So I'm gonna hold it this way. Pick a random number, save $103. And it's in D's Digital World on her Etsy shop. That's the name of her Etsy shop, which I'm sure that still is. But I would just double check on her YouTube channel just to verify. If it's not, I'll put it. I'll put it right here. I'll put it right here. And um, her YouTube channel is D. It's D's Bankroll. Okay. Ooh, that was a lot. I said a lot. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cross off a one and a two. And a two. Okay. So that's three dollars we're gonna put towards this one. And we're gonna do four dollars on this guy. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Do I have and where's my purple? Um I don't have okay, I have my green. Do I have my purple? Hold on, let me find my purple. I have to find my purple. So we're gonna put four dollars in this guy. One, two, three, four. But I have to, hold on, I need to, I need to find my purple, be right back. Okay, I'm back, I found my purple. Okay, 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 okay. So um, we're gonna color in the gnome's hat with purple. And this challenge, this cutie challenge, is from One Frugal Introvert. It's the St. Patrick's Day Challenge. I realize that we're in June doing a St. Patrick's Day Challenge. But as I say, money is money and saving is saving. So it doesn't matter what holiday you're saving for or what, what holiday the challenge has on it. It's still saving money, y'all, and you can still use it for whatever you want to. So um, you can find this in her Etsy shop, and it comes in a three-pack with a uh, savings tracker and a, I think it's a couple challenges. So go check her out. And we're gonna color in the four leaf clover. Okay. And we've got our $4 we're gonna put with that one. And I'm gonna skip, oh well, no. We're gonna put a dollar here. And we're going to put a dollar here. And this challenge, oh, I'm sorry. This challenge right here is from Budgeting April. It is the Greenwood District Challenge. It is the Greenwood Neighborhood. It's an historical, it's a historical African-American neighborhood. If you don't know, you need to Google it and you get all the information on the Greenwood District. And um, I think this is an amazing challenge that April created. So check her out on her Etsy shop. I'm not sure if it's on the Etsy shop, but um, you can go check it out. Um, yeah, this is a roll of dice, save the amount. You can save up to $300 on this challenge. So we put a dollar towards this challenge, crossed off the $1 bill, and we're gonna put this over here. And this is my own DIY savings challenge that I made with Dollar Tree products. And we're gonna cross off that dollar and put a dollar in that one. So we have, we have exhausted all of our funds and all of our savings challenges. I did spread out the love, which I'm very happy with. So um, check out some of these budgeters and um, get some of these challenges because they are adorable and they're all so creative and they're just, they're just awesome little challenges. So if you don't have a lot of money, go ahead and check them out because none of these are really high denomination challenges. So, and put this right here. I didn't even put how much we were putting in here. I guess we'll figure it out. <laughs> I'll figure it out at the end of the month. Um, so there you go. There you go, there you go, there you go. I'll put the money in there and there you go. So we are done. I'm going to cover up my pins, put my pins back so I don't have to run around all the apartment looking for them. And there you go. Boom. 
So we have stuffed all of the savings challenges, y'all. I'm surprised I was able to do it. I gave every savings challenge I'm working on a little bit of love and I'm happy about it. So um, I think that's it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope that you um, like these types of videos, these savings challenges videos. And like I said, I only have $44 and I did what I could. I stretched the mess out of those $44. Just like the screaming stuff. Yes. That was, you didn't, you didn't hear it. I heard it. It was in the background. So <laughs> I'm so silly. I hope you enjoyed this video. And do we have a hashtag for today? Yes, we do. Hashtag stretch. Hashtag stretch. So, um, had to check and see if I was recording because you know, that's what your girl does now. Um, so, uh, if you like to leave a comment, put in the comments, hashtag stretch, and I will catch you in the next one. I hope you have a great rest of the month and I will talk to you in the next one. Take care. Bye.